right, so we're picking up right from where we left off last time. And we are headed for the church where something is amiss. I think I've already possessed everybody over here. Oh. I'm still missing some stuff, though, but I'll have to go back later and get that. Although I hate to have to start all over again. May save that for when I stream. Yes. Wow, I actually missed some stuff over here. Six more, that's a bunch. I've been over here. Be rad, okay. Oh god. What have I done? No, 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 no. Rick. And Laura, they're they're dead. It's all my fault. Hey, hey, hey. Calm down for a second and talk to me. What's your name? Uh, oh, uh Brad. Good. Now, tell me what happened. I don't know. We were out in the town blowing off some steam. One drink turned into three, and three turned into... Who knows how many? The details are hazy. I... I must have been driving Rick and Laura home when... Oh, God! I killed them! I'll never forgive myself for doing this! You don't know if you did. You said it yourself. The details are hazy. Now, I can take a look around here and see if anything jumps out at me. God, what have I done? Zero of three clues. Okay, see here, I thought that was B-Rad, but no. <laughs> it was Brad. <laughs> This must be Brad's car. It's not looking good. No, it's not looking good. Guessing the clues are all close by. Huh. It's not much, but it's something. Gas station's not far from here. I should check it out. Come from the gas station? I think I just came from there. Back we go. such a lightweight. One of five, huh? I hope he doesn't ghost puke. <laughs> Well, that was startlingly disgusting. If cops aren't safe, who is safe? That doesn't help any. Yeah, the SOC. 
Okay. Great. So he called for a cab. I guess after he got through puking over here. Lucho Burrito. But just keep adding oil faster than a leak. Should last another year. Why am I gonna make this so difficult? Rick was puking, she was pumping gas, and he was making a call. And I need three of them, so I guarantee you I need the other two. I don't know if these two have anything to do with it or not. When she heard that loud noise and cut it short. It must be the crash. She walked right through me. Freaked me out. Do I have enough clues now, or what? Ugh. I love this game, but sometimes it's a little bit frustrating. I should go home now. Throw it out a window. That would be so awful. Yeah, it wasn't a lot of fun. Okay, so we got the whiskey. We got the license plate. We got the gas receipt. I don't know what else we need. And this big wall here in the middle making it very difficult. Maybe it was the taxi? I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking for here. Ooh, that's the church. We don't want to go that way. Oh my goodness. Here it is. Oh. 
Okay, so I think that's all of them. Okay, so it was this guy I had to talk to. Wish I hadn't slammed the door so hard. The stupid window was coming out of my paycheck. I was just so pissed at those drunken assholes. Who do they think has to clean up their puke? Jerks like that discourage business. I never should have let that woman drive off. I should have just called the cops. So... Brad wasn't driving after all. It was Laura. Well, I can't change what happened, but he'll be glad to know he wasn't the one behind the wheel. Okay, so she was driving. Does SOC gas ring any bells? Wait. Uh, I remember stopping to uh, fill up. You guys did more than fill up. The cashier wasn't thrilled to clean up after your buddy Rick. And you even tried to call a cab. God. I, I don't remember any of that. When the cashier came storming out, you guys took off with Laura behind the wheel. So, I wasn't driving. Oh. oh, that whole night was a disaster. It's hard to accept my part in things, but at least I know it wasn't all my fault. I don't uh, know what to say. Uh, thank you. You are ever so welcome. That'll be seventy nine ninety five. Well, that was worth a try. Five more. I swear I've already been over here and those things weren't here before. Light. I thought it was something glowing. Now that's something. Julia's thoughts. Salem feels dangerous. Salem is supposed to be a quiet place, the kind of place where you can escape the problems of a big city, but it's getting to where I don't feel safe walking outside at night here anymore. I talked with Ronan about it, and he tries to assure me that he's the most dangerous guy in this town, but the bravado doesn't help much. Something is sick about this place. You're right there. So I need one more of those. Oh, okay. Not going that way already. Three more.
Two more and a kitty cat. Let me guess. There's probably something up there I need to guess. <laughs> Ninja cat. Oh, hey. Careful, kitty. One more. See anything else? Well, that's a weird little dead end, but okay. <laughs> 